they call him undisputed champion of the world, but we have a boxer who's by the name of Rocky Kid Canvas back. Rocky Kid, come on in. Boy, it's great to have you today, Rocky. How in the world, though, do, do these people know that you're a boxer? Boxer shorts. Yes. Rocky Kid Canvas back. How do you, how do you feel being on Nash, uh, Nationwide TV? Uh, hi, Mom. Hi, Dad. <laughs> oh. What's so funny? I'm an orphan. <laughs> well, Rocky Kid, we know that you have an upcoming outdoor match in Montreal. And if I'm not mistaken, it's pretty cool up there. Uh, don't you, won't you get cold? Uh, no, we wear gloves. <laughs> how old are you anyway? Uh, 36. Now let me see, Rocky, how in the world did you ever get started in this fighting business? Well, when I was a kid, I used to go around in the block, or everybody on my block, I beat up everybody on my block. Well, that is, except for the Joneses. Well, why couldn't you beat the Jones kids? Oh, because they were boys. <laughs> now let's see, Rocky. How many fights uh, have you had? Let's see, uh, 101. I won them all, except the first 100. Got a win streak going now. <laughs> Well, Rocky, I read in the papers a few weeks back that you had dropped out of boxing for a while, and uh, I wonder why you quit. Oh, I broke my hand. Hitting a, uh, an opponent, I suppose. No, uh, the referee stepped on it. <laughs> now, how old did you, now, how old did you say you were? Uh, 42. Okay. You know, I'm sure, Rocky, as you uh, crawl into the rain, you fight a lot of guys, all different sizes. I'm sure that you have fought some awfully big guys before. How do you feel about fighting these guys who are so much bigger than yourself? Well, you know, it's like I always say, the bigger they are, the harder they get. <laughs> yep, I understand that. Let me ask you something, Rocky, while we have you here. Uh, have, you ever, have you ever fought any true world champs? Yeah, there was Joe Lewis that time. I fought him in the arena. Man, I had him going to have him really scared in the first round. Really scared. I'm sure he was probably afraid of that uh, powerful right punch you have, right? No, he thought he'd kill me. <laughs> now, back when Joe uh, beat you uh, and you was knocked out, did they have to bring in a stretcher to carry you out, or how'd they do that? No, I wear handles on my trunks. <laughs> how old did you say you were again? Fifty-six. <laughs> There's lots of lots in the news, and we we see in the news uh, lots of times about people fixing fights. And I wonder, has anyone ever asked you to throw one? Yeah, I remember against the Kid Ringo back last year. They told me to throw it in the sixth round. Now surely you didn't do it, did you? No, never made it to the sixth round. <laughs> <laughs> now, as you're boxing. Uh, is it, is it ever anything unusual, you know, different than, than most fights? Everything any, uh, unusual ever happened to you? Uh, yeah. There was that time against, who was that guy? Tiger Lewis. And he punched me in the nose in the first round, and my nose didn't bleed until the fifth round. Wow. Why do you think that happened? Tired blood. <laughs> <laughs> now, I know that these boxers have to wear these uh, bulky mouthpieces, and at times, I'm sure they have to get uncomfortable. Uh, does yours ever give you any trouble? Uh, just when I'm eating. <laughs> <laughs> now, how old did you say you were? 62. Now, why do you keep asking me this? Are you a punchy or something? Now, I, you know, uh, Rocky, we're about to conclude this interview, and, and I have this kid at home, he's about 14, and uh, he wants to get into boxing. Do you have any advice that you can give him? You got a kid, huh? That wants to box. <laughs> well, my advice to him would be live right, eat well, and keep breathing. In and out. <laughs> keep breathing. If he stops for more than three minutes, <laughs> oh, he go around hitting people. Go around hitting people? Just, just anybody? Just go around hitting anybody? No, I'm hitting little people. <laughs> Little kid, hit it. It's all kicking. That's what people do. Just go around, live right, eat well, and keep breathing. Wow. Uh, you are, you are a great guy, a great champion. Thank you. Now back to our station.